Yeah. 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 We have a delicacy of crickets, scorpions, and mealworms. <laughs> Judges are readily available to talk to, and they've always offered me room for improvement. Mm -hmm. So um, I, I felt everybody's always been generous here. Mm -hmm. So um, I've taken what I've learned from here and used it at other shows, mm -hmm. and that has definitely worked in my favor. And what made you decide to enter OSIS? I have been putting this off for many years. I wanted to do it six years ago, but then I never thought I'm not like I'm not good enough to do it. Mm -hmm. Then I've gotten over that where it doesn't matter if you're good enough. Right? because you're not going to grow if you don't challenge yourself, yourself. So this was a test for me to challenge myself. Because to keep your cake shows going, you need to enter a cake. Yeah. There have to be cakes for people to look at. I kept telling myself that if you don't push yourself, you never advance. The challenge, a personal challenge. It should never be a challenge about the next person. It's about you and bettering yourself. Ah, I entered this because it seems to be the biggest show in America, at least, for this sort of field. And um, I wanted to show people that cookies can be just as big and bizarre as cakes and sort of shift people out of that cookie cutter mindset because, you know, we're, cookies are cool too, cake people out there and, you know, just wanted to sort of push boundaries and limits and really show what they could be. I entered because I don't do wedding cakes. I don't do wedding cakes like that, like the ones you guys will see. And I kind of want to change the direction of the wedding style at this show. Because I want to challenge myself to do something I haven't done before. 